God forgive us. One. Two. if it was an inch, and I plucked him off neat as a feather. Of course, it was the hand of Jehovah that reached down and smote him. Adam, praise be you're all right. How are you keeping, son? I'm all right, sir. I'm looking for Mr. Simmons. We were separated. What a glorious day, praise be to How can you feel that way? Killing and enjoying it. An eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth and no mercy is the way he sees it, Adam. He's been looking forward to this for a good long while. Your name's Solomon Chandler? Hey, you in charge? I'm captain of militia. We ain't got a general here. We got 53 men from Watertown. More of them joined us from Lincoln, Bedford, and Monotomy. Where do we go? We go? Well, you go to where you see redcoats. You fire, you keep moving. Fire, keep moving. We'll leapfrog them all the way back to Boston. Solomon! There's a British relief force coming, fresh out of Boston, and now a mile the other side of Lexington. How many? We hear 1,500. Well, they'll come together in Lexington then with what's left of these. Well, what do we do? The same as we've already done. We'll let them march to where they're going, and we'll get them when they're coming. Well, yes, but what if they take a different road? <laughs> Friend, there ain't a road in Massachusetts today that don't lead to British graves. You soldier bullet! Keep right! Surrender. Surrender? To whom, you bloody fool? They have no leader.
kicking against the tide all my life, lady. Thinking I was alone. <laughs> but today, I'm in the company of brothers. America. Sir, if I go on, I'm going to die. I know I will. Please just go home. Please, Mr. Simmons, I just want to go home. Seasons, things change. Changes life. Life is good. terrible for you today. I was just really confused. No one seemed to know much about what to do except shoot at the Redcoats. Did you? A few times, yes. Did you kill anyone? I don't know. I tried. Did you want to? Oh, no, no. I don't hate anyone enough to want to kill them. I'm glad you feel that way. It isn't the same anymore. We aren't the same. This morning, when we lined up on the green, no one in it intended to fight. Now we know that we have to. But you won't go, will you? Go where? Every man and every boy old enough to bear arms has been called to surround the British in Boston. I know you will. I don't want you to. I know you will. 